in the sixth question given the triangle ABC is an isosceles triangle in which AB is equal to AC and side BA is producer to D such that AD is equal to AB then show that angle BCD is right angle. Now moving on to solution. Let us consider separately the two triangles triangle ABC and triangle ACD in which two of the sides are equal. In triangle ABC AB is equal to AC. So we can say that angle B will be equal to angle C as in triangle angles opposite to equal sides are equal that is angle ABC is equal to angle ACD and also in triangle AD AD is equal to AC so we can say that angle ABC is equal to angle ACD as they are angles opposite to equal sides AD and AC that is angle ADC is equal to angle ACD. Let us assume this to be as two equations. Now on adding both the equations we get angle ACB angle ABC plus angle ADC is equal to angle ACB plus angle ACD which implies angle ABC plus angle ADC will be equal to angle ACB plus angle ACD is equal to whole angle BCD. Now we shall consider the whole triangle BCD. In this we know that in triangle sum of angles is equal to 180 degrees we can say angle BDC plus angle BCD plus angle DDC is equal to 180 degrees let it be as equation number 3 and here if we observe clearly angle BDC is equal to angle ADC we can replace this plus angle BCD plus angle DBC is equal to angle ABC which is equal to 180 degrees this will be the equation 2 which implies this can be written as angle BCD plus angle ADC plus angle ABC is equal to 180 degrees. Here we have angle ADC plus angle ABC is equal to angle BCD from the first equation. Let us substitute that. Therefore we get angle BCD plus angle BCD is equal to 180 degrees. Which implies 2 times angle BCD is equal to 180 degrees which implies angle BCD is equal to 180 degrees by 2 which is equal to 90 degrees hence we got angle BCD is equal to 90 degrees which is the proof required for us.